Goodness me. I don't think I've seen so many house martins. Amazing. Oops, that one was a bit close. <laughs> I'm in uh, South Lanarkshire, 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 Lan Lanarkshire, Lanarkshire, whatever it is. Um, and I've passed this, um, well, there's, there's a couple of lakes around here. I've, I've passed them a few times in the past and I've always wanted to stop. So I've, I've took the opportunity today to come and have a look at them. Um, the sun is a bit too bright, um, so it's very contrasty, but I'll take a few shots. I might even uh, turn some into black and white. So this is my first composition, pretty simple stuff really. This uh, is a lock-in with some trees in the middle of the island. There's some what look like water leaves. I'm not an expert on um, flowers, but yeah, pretty straightforward stuff. I've got my 24 to 70 mil lens on and um, I'm shooting at ISO 160, an aperture of F9, and I'm getting about 400th of a second. Like I say, a pretty straightforward stuff, but goodness me, what a place. Lovely here. So here's the resultant image. I'm not a big fan of it, to be honest. I don't like the foreground too much. The light could be better. And you're probably wondering why I was on ISO 160 and quite a wide aperture. The reason was to get a fast shutter speed because if you notice from the video footage, it was really, really windy and I had to keep everything sharp and still. I don't like doing long exposures in the wind because the trees move and to me, that's totally off-putting in the image. I prefer to have everything stationary really, or to a certain degree. But still, I think it's an okay shot, but it's certainly not a portfolio shot, that's for sure. So here's the image I went for. This is much stronger in my opinion. The texture in the shot is fantastic due to the direction of the light, the moody sky, and then we've got nice foreground interest. From a higher viewpoint, it gives the picture a lot more depth as well. I, I, I think you would agree with that. Any remarks that you have, I'll be interested to see what you feel. But for me, this is a banger of a shot compared to the other one. Well, that's a first. I've lost the end off my tripod. <laughs> One of the legs, the little stopper at the bottom. Uh, can you see it? I don't know if you can see that or not. Oh, not the best. It's come off in the mud. <laughs> Brilliant. So I hope you don't mind me walking and talking at the same time. Um, I've noticed that on yeah, YouTube, like there's, there's a few vlogs and a few people are like complaining about other vloggers and stuff. I, I don't know why, but like saying, oh, they do clickbait and things like that. Well, if that's what they do, fair enough. I mean, I'm not really bothered <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, they like my pictures, they don't. That's, that's, that's the way it is. Obviously it's nice to get followers and stuff like that, but at the end of the day, it's just a hobby. Um, I know for some people it's, it's uh, like a living, but I think sometimes these people need to get over themselves a little bit and stop slacking other people off. Uh, honestly. I was going to try to get the drone out, but um, that's a non-starter. It's so windy uh, today 
I got it up about 10 feet and it was blown everywhere. So I won't be flying the drone, which is a bit of a pity. It would have been quite nice around here, I think. Uh, but yeah, it's far too windy. The, the drone, drone was really struggling. Um, so yeah, and I don't want to damage it really. So there's always another time. Let's crack on. So this is castle turret or part of a castle or I don't know what it is. But yeah, cool. I might get a black and white of this. Well, it started to belt down with rain, so I'm hiding in this little castle turret thing, wherever it is. But yeah, I'm sure it's going to pass soon, and then we'll crack on, but yeah, just hiding for now until the rain stops. 